In this Planet Zoo tutorial series, I'm tackling topics that can be answered in two minutes or less. Today's topic, using the Steam Workshop. To download a blueprint, go to Steam, click on the Community tab and search for Planet Zoo. This will take you to the Workshop page. Anything you like, click on it, hit the subscribe button and that'll import the build into your game. Once in game, click on the Blueprints tab and Steam Workshop downloads will show in here. Some items will need you to relaunch the game to work, others might take a while to show up. Also, if you're playing in franchise mode, items using building themes that you haven't researched yet will show up as locked. You need to unlock these items through researching with the mechanic first before you can use the blueprint in franchise mode. Okay, to upload to the workshop, if it's a building piece like this weird little dome I made, select all the pieces of your build with the multi-select tool. Then in this tab, select save selection as blueprint, add a name, description and any tags that will reflect what your build is and create blueprint. This will save the item as a local blueprint. Just bear in mind blueprints are limited to 4,000 pieces. To get it onto the workshop, go back into blueprints, find what you want to upload and click this icon to upload to the workshop. Then you need to go through the same process to name and add a description and hit create workshop item. When it's uploaded, be sure to go into the blueprint in Steam and in the owner control sidebar, make sure this is set to public so others can see your work. To upload a habitat, click the boundary of your habitat and the save as blueprint icon at the bottom here. This will take you through the same process as before. To add a whole zoo to the workshop, from the main menu, go into My Zoos and when you highlight a zoo, it will give you the option to upload to workshop. Bear in mind, you can only do this with sandbox mode zoos. And that's it. I hope this has been helpful. Leave a comment if there's anything that wasn't clear though and I'll make sure to respond. Thanks for watching. Bye for now.